Hey everybody, welcome to Tailbox of Reviews. I'm Stan with my lovely wife Tanya here again. We're doing a teaser trailer reaction to Terminator Dark Fate. Um, I love Terminator 1 and 2. I don't even call it Terminator 3. I call that the Governor campaign ad. <laughs> um, yeah, and Salvation had like such promise and then it kind of let me down. Genesis was just horrendously bad. Um, I think like this is going to be interesting seeing like I don't know if it's a direct sequel or whatever it is but a 71 year old Arnold and a 62 year old Linda Hamilton's back <laughs> and that's that's a selling point for me freaking Linda Hamilton back. because uh her and James Cameron uh were together when you know they made one and two then they divorced and I don't know what he said to her to, to get her back for it but um <laughs> You know, maybe. Well, hopefully, it's a good script. And well, that's apparently, what's Cameron. Older. Yeah, Cameron wrote it, and he's producing it. He got the rights back to it. That's why he's um doing it. And I don't know, just him and Arnold teamed up again. Even if it is in a producer's role, like yeah, it's going to be interesting. But yeah, no, I'm excited to see what they're going to do, where they're going to take it, and um, just the fact that. What's the um, storyline? Yeah, you know, Linda is back, so Cause this she's isn't just the... a badass woman. Yeah, the first... So I'm uh, excited to see what she does. The first handful of, like, badass women before all this, like, kind of, you know, freaking, oh, it's a big women's movement. No, it happened years ago when these, like, Sigourney Weaver and Linda Hamilton were hammering the... You know, history books and stuff. Just that shot of her with the um, minigun. Yeah. It was just like, dang. Let's just watch it. Okay. Cool. <laughs> Two days ago, I had this nice, simple life. And now it's a nightmare. If travel is searching, then home has been found. I'm not stopping. Sarah Connor. Never seen one like you before. Almost human. I am human. Why do you care what happens to her? Because I was her. How do we win? We win by keeping you alive. I'm going hunting. It's a good song for it. All right. Okay, so I think what? Is they gonna try to save this young human? I'm guessing that it's changed um, because what this is what I'm going off. James Cameron had an interview a while back about how we're living in an age now where we are so reliant on technology and everything. We have drone warfare. We have like, you know, different stuff like that. He goes into the whole like talk about is there story and stuff 
for this franchise. And he's like, kind of, he more or less says, with what I've got, like, you know, my ideas that I didn't share throughout the years with all these other, you know, Terminator 3 and Salvation and Genesis, like, he's like, yeah, there's plenty of story where I, what I've got, but he's like, this is off my timeline. This is off Judgment Day, like, kind of timeline. So he goes into the, like, he, he just mentions that, you know, is there any way, like, to tie an Arnold into this? Well, you got to have the DNA of that person come from somewhere. And um, I just think I've got a feeling that Cameron's not going to do that. He's not going to be like, well, Arnold's just a human in this one that they got the DNA from. I think he's going to make Arnold an actual Terminator. The first one? I don't know. One that probably goes back and tells Linda Hamilton, um, you postponed Judgment Day, you and John, when we destroyed the, um, you know, the original copy and stuff. But now, like, it's eventually going to, it's still coming. Well, I reckon because she said, like, um, you know, that young girl, that's me. It's like, so she's an innocent bystander who's... She's going to give birth to the saviour of humanity. she's the saviour or... Something to do with saving the world. That bit yeah. we got from the trailer. So it's like she has to help this other, I guess, superhuman? Since she said that she's human or cyberhuman? Well, it showed a shot of her, like, beating up cops. The, um, I forget what her name, Mackenzie something. Yeah. Um, she was in uh, The Martian. Like, it looks like, yeah, she has come back in time. Yeah. So that's what I'm kind of going off. But it's pretty cool. It's a good teaser. I'm happy with it. It's got me interested. But when I saw Arnold and I was just like, oh, God, that nostalgia is like <laughs> kind of coming back. Like, you know, freaking uh, I'm I'm excited. Like the fact that James Cameron's back and stuff. But um, yeah, anything else you can no, think of? No, it just looks good. So I can't wait to see more little hints along the way of what this is going to be all about. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if it's October or November, but yeah. Still can't wait for it to come. <laughs> Check us out on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Make sure you comment below on what you thought of this trailer. Thanks, Thanks for watching, watching. guys. Bye. Bye.